Hello everyone, thanks for tuning in. Today we are going to be talking about managing memberships and subscriptions in Wix. So let's get started. Let's talk about managing memberships first. On your Wix editor, go to the My Business button. From here, select Wix Members area. Scroll down a bit and see and click on Manage Members. A dashboard window will open. Wait for it to load up. And you'll automatically be taken to your site member page. This is where you can see your subscribers or members' names, their login email, their roles, as well as the plans that they're subscribed to, and their last login date. You can also see additional tabs, namely Pending and Blocked. The Pending tab is where you can see site members that are still waiting for your approval. And of course, the Blocked tab is where you can find users you've blocked. For more options, you have two buttons above, More Actions and Manage Member Roles. For more actions, here are the things that you can do. By the way, keep in mind that depending on the website you're creating, the items that show up here on the menu will vary sometimes. So in our case, here are the things we can do under More Actions. Set Permissions, Add Role, Member Privacy, Manage Member Info, Manage Badges, and Sign Up and Login Security Settings. As for the Manage Member Roles, if we click on it, we'll be able to see this on our screen. From the name itself, create roles for different members of your site and set their permissions. Roles can be anything that suits your site, like students, staff, or VIP. If you want to learn more, click on Learn More. Now let's talk about managing your website's plans or subscriptions. So now we're going to close this and we're going to go back to our editor. Once again, we're going to go to the My Business button. But this time, we will be selecting Wix Pricing Plans. From here, Click on Manage Plans. Another new dashboard window will appear. And this is where you can see the plans you've previously created. Here you can see your plan names, pricing, duration, and status. In case you want to edit a certain plan, just hover over it and click on Edit. If you need more actions to do on that specific plan, click on the three dot button and here you can create a coupon, hide that specific plan, or archive that specific plan. Now let's try to see more options that we can do. So let's go back to the editor and close this window. Go back to the My Business button. Click on Wix Pricing Plans again. And over here, you can see different things you can do. You can manage plans, create a plan, manage purchases, customize, customize plans page, add pricing plans elements, manage email automations, and this is also where you can set up your payment methods. These are pretty easy to understand and are quite simple to navigate as well. So feel free to select what you'd like to do and edit or customize your plans however you like. And like always, don't forget to save your changes by clicking on the Save button, just in case your autosave is turned off. It's always good to make sure that your progress has always been saved. And that's all for today. We hope you found today's video of help somehow. If you need more Wix tutorials, check out our channel and consider subscribing. Thanks for watching!